Hi, my name is Tom Casey. I wanted to do a short, quick video today on your limousine company. Basically, the purpose of this video is to compare you with one of your competitors in terms of where you guys follow in search results when people are searching online for limo service in Fort Worth. Um, there's just two factors I'm going to cover today. I'm going to keep this video short, but I do want to point two things out to you. Uh, before I do that, how I want to show you quickly how many people are searching online for limo service. This is a tool from Google. It does a, um, a count by month of a number of people searching for a particular term. In this case, we're looking for people that are searching for limo service in Fort Worth. And I went back the last 12 months, okay? And this is how many people are searching a month. There's 590, 880, 1,000, 590. It rounds it up to like the nearest 10. But anyway, there's a lot of people searching, obviously. Um, it's a little bit all over the map, but it's still well into the, um, over the 300s. In some cases, there's 880 for, and then 480 uh, for last month. So that's a lot of people searching for limo service. I thought this would be a good exercise. So what I did, went over here to Google and did a search for limo service in Fort Worth. And here we are on page one. Okay. And let's see where I found you. You are over here. And you are welcome to JV Limousines. And you are on page three. Okay, so again, what I wanted to do is just look at two factors. Uh, these are two factors that uh, the search engines consider when they're doing rankings. But obviously they consider more than two, but again, to keep this video short, we're just going to look at two. So I want to compare you with somebody on this page. Let's see if there's any differences in these two factors. And if there is, if there's anything that can be done about those differences to improve where you rank. Okay, so the first factor I'm going to talk about today is something called citations. Now a citation is a listing for your business on a directory site. It's a name, address, phone number listing. Okay? And I'm going to give you an example. This website right here goes out and finds directory sites. Okay? Here's one <coughs> called ypocregister.com. So, as an example, if JV Limousines had a listing on ypocregister.com, a name, address, phone number listing, that is considered one citation, okay? Now, search engines like citations because they feel like the more citations you have, the more legitimate you are, and therefore they want to rank you higher than someone who has fewer citations than you do, okay? Now, at the top of this web page, you can actually do citation counts. You can put a business name in, and it will give you the count, total citations that they have. So here you are, JV Limousines, and it's telling me you have 58 citations, okay? Now the, the uh, company we're going to compare ourselves to is called Silver West Limousines. Here they are, and they are on page one. So Silver West is right here. They have 211 citations, so that's quite a bit more than you. Um, however, the good news is you can quickly and easily get added to these directory sites. So this number 58, <clears throat> we can get that well into the 100s in short order. Just by doing that, it's going to have a very nice positive impact in terms of where you rank when people are searching for limo service. You're definitely going to be moving up in the ranks, okay, just by doing that. That's one factor. The second and last factor I'm going to talk about is something called backlinks. Now a backlink is a link from one website to your website. As an example, if there was a website called FortWorthLimoSupplies.com and they had a link to JVLimousines.com on their website, and obviously it went to your site, that is considered one backlink. Now search engines like backlinks even more than they like citations. Again, for similar reasons, they feel it makes you more legitimate and they want to rank you higher than someone who has fewer backlinks than you do. Okay? Now this website I'm on actually does a backlink count. So I put your website in here, and the number we want to look at is unique. So you're telling me you have seven unique active backlinks. Okay, let's go look at Silver West. Okay, Silver West has 16, so a little bit more than double than you. But again, good news is we can add backlinks to your site. <clears throat> we probably would only need to add maybe eight or ten quality backlinks. We want to make sure they're not coming from spammy or scammy sites. But if we just add eight or ten links, and get this number up to like 15 or 16 or 17, 16 or 17, that would be huge for you. <clears throat> you would um, really move up uh, in search results 
uh, definitely more people would see you, you should get more phone calls. Okay, so again, we just talked about two factors today, which you can see even with just these two factors, that there is a difference between you and somebody who's on that other page of Google. But you're also learning that there are steps we can take to eliminate those differences and mitigate them. And when we do that, just with these two factors alone, it's going to have a very, very positive impact on where you rank when people are searching for limo service. So anyway, I hope you found this helpful. This is what I do for a living, but I don't charge for consulting. So if you want more information about what I've talked about today, uh, it's free. If you want me to talk about other factors I talk about with my other customers in terms of things that impact search results, that's free. If you want me to review your website, that's free. There is no cost, no obligation. So anyway, feel free to give me a call or shoot me an email. Hope you have a great day. Bye now.